What's up everybody and welcome to my Rory McIlroy PGA Tour career mode. We're making Happy Gilmore. Gotta get this creation done right here. There's no true creation to, you know, just getting selected randomly to go join a tournament and end up making it to the tour. So we just go with the call get. We're choosing our heads. Gotta figure out what we want to do here, which looks similar to. I'm just gonna go with head five. It's like... He's really, this sort of detail in this game is not that good. I, I gotta say it's not that good. But anyway, we gotta play the web.com tour. And my plan for this series is, in the web.com tour, I had it on quick rounds, just showing rounds, uh, like you play four or five holes, four or five, six holes in a round, and then that's how I play in the rest get simulated. But I plan on switching it to a full 18 holes. And what I'll do, like I did in this episode, only show... Rounds 3 and 4, not bother showing the first two rounds, showing rounds 3 and 4, and only showing holes where I either get a birdie, bogey, whatever. I'm not going to show the holes where I get a park, so there's no point in that. I didn't uh, lose a stroke or go gain a stroke, so there's no point in showing them. The web.com tour championship is where we're kicking this one off. Just got to get ready for it. We gotta make a splash, especially with Happy Gilmore. Gotta make the tournament right here. And I'm gonna try to get the gear. It's, I didn't bother doing it for this one, but as close as I can. Obviously, there's no Boston Bruins jersey. But I gotta get it as close as I can. So playing at TPC Sawgrass, jumping right into the third round. You see, I'm minus three so far. And first place going into the round. But again, that does change since I don't have... An early tea time, and I'm sorry for the black screen. That, that's just how it took a bit of time to load up, honestly. So here we go, get some visuals. Tied for first place, getting the last tea or second last tea time. Starting off on the second hole here, co-leader, first stroke, got a nice drive there, right down the middle of the fairway. Not a bad shot at all. Don't want to go on the rough. What a way to start the one out on a long par five. 550 yards that's one of the longer holes on the course if not the longest one i gotta say second shot coming up here and i have customized swing control so i got the blue line to sort of show me but i can't see exactly where the shot's gonna land up i can go to the course over map showing how far specific things is we put that one into the rough but almost making it onto the green in two shots we're just gonna do a little chip on right here Get on the green in three. Chance for a birdie. And we roll that one nice and close. So birdie's all but inevitable at this point in time, as you know. Wouldn't show a par if I got it. Gotta aim this one a little bit. Gonna tap that one in. Nice little putt there. And I'm sort of trying the series out as well. So you see minus four as well. Let me know what you want me to do. If you want me to not show the... Or I guess show the drives. But I guess I can show the drive. Do a bit more cuts in between. Because right now what I'm doing is that one... Almost went in for a hole in one, but I'm just showing the whole hole. Like, I'm just putting it all together. I'm not taking out any of the cuts in between. So, what I could do is like that little part where it zoomed into the golfer. I guess I can take that one out to make it go by a bit quicker. But again, getting used to it, I also got to figure out what I, how I want to carry on with this series. If I want to show every tournament or just every other one of the important ones, like the majors and whatnot. So this is where I need some input. If you guys want to, just put it in the comments down below what you want to see. Is That's a nice shot on the par 4. Getting this nice and close to the green. You got to chip it on here. And again, so I can cut this part out as well where I'm changing my club. Just get it to exactly where I want it. And we got the Bo's heartbeat. This one's going to be close. It's perfectly straight. And look where that stops. Inches from going in the cup for an eagle. Inches from going in the cup. Instead, we got to settle for a birdie. But again, I'll take it building my lead up. Going to minus six now. We got to finish in the top 50, I think it is, to qualify. We almost guaranteed that as this day is done. Through the four holes we got to play. Finish minus three on the day. And you see, we finished the day as shooting a 69 minus 3. Starting off the final round in first by one stroke. We get to play the final hole. So here's the 15th hole. Great drive hitting this one right down the middle of the fairway. It leaks a bit to the left, actually. But we're not in the rough, so that'll set us up for a nice and easy second shot on this hole. This is, so, like I was saying, this is the part I, I think I'm going to cut this part out, actually, because don't really know, don't have much to say for that part. And again, this part, we're aiming it. I'll just cut it out, get right to the shot, and cut this part out as well. So, I think I sort of figured out what I want to do. Because there's nothing, there's nothing really I can say in that part. I just want to get the shot made. And that's a nice one. Second shot. Come bringing it right to within 10 feet 
of the hole, giving us a nice birdie chance set up right here. As we don't even have an actual caddy yet, gotta aim this one, gonna make the putt, and it just goes in, catching the lower lip of the cup, giving us a birdie and bringing us to a minus seven. Second place actually bogeyed that hole, so we're now up to a three stroke lead. We got the Bo's big hit, starting this one off, we're crushing that one. This one's gonna go a long ways. And we got the 5 mile an hour forward win. So the carry on it is 184. And it will roll to 304 yards. And I know that's not that much. But considering this is the first turn with the golfer. So you got all the base stats. I was hit pretty far. So again, 5 mile an hour win forward. Cup is right on the edge of the green around where the water is. We're going to hit this one. It's going to be a bit short as it rolls a good amount. But again, reaching the green in two. On a par 5, we can 2 putt and still get a birdie and go down to minus 8. And really, that's what we're looking at right here. This is a long eagle putt. And with these custom settings, with the blue line, it was way too easy to get it in. I had to take that off. You see, we're short and it would have rolled way off to the right. Put it closer, though, for a nice little birdie putt. Pretty flat in this part of the green. We're just going to aim it a bit. To the left here. We're going to tap that one. It'll easily sink. Going to minus 8 on the day. And building this lead up. Almost guaranteed. We're guaranteed a spot pretty much at this point. With two holes left. Uh, on a spot. To the PGA Tour. This is the nice hole right here. All surrounded by water. We're going to put this one up. It's going to fall down. And we put this one. Within a foot of the hole. We were seeking the pin right there. And if we had just a bit more spin, gonna tap this one in for birdie. Minus nine now. And that is a great way to finish through 17 on the 18th hole. I did par it up. Finishing with the 69 shot on the day. Minus three. And we win the tournament. We were sort of expecting it as this is the web.com championship. Once we get to the PGA Tour, I expect it to be a lot harder. And there you can see the stats that have been upgraded through the four days. No point in showing those until the end. Simulating, we're going to get our sponsorships. And there you go. So, and uh, Lat Latvia, I want to say, and one other country. So here we go. We win the web.com tour and graduate. 50 players who earn our PGA Tour card. And I guess we're wearing EA Sports. They're our first sponsorship. And Gilmore said he's been wearing EA Sports his whole entire life. So he's happy to wear him now. And of course, EA Sports is happy to get its sponsorship on a new golfer to the PGA Tour. So anyways, in the next episode, I guess to show the very first PGA Tour tournament, the Career Builder Challenge. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe for more content. Peace!